Well, I've shot up Young and Dundas Square. Again, it's uh, we're not on the patio today because we don't know if it's going to rain or not. So we're staying dry. Good to see you. Dina Pugliese, Sid Sixero. A little thing we call breakfast television. Indeed. It's the show where the temptation is sometimes too hot to handle. Not our show. The show you're introducing. Well, I don't know. That haircut segment was pretty good. <laughs> Season two of the steamy reality dating show is back with new contestants. And one of them happens to be from Toronto. Please welcome Carly Lawrence from the new season of Too Hot to Handle live here on BT. Good morning, Carly. How you doing? Come on. Morning. I'm good. Thank you. How are you? Top trending show on Netflix. We're not doing as well as you are, Carly. Okay, let's talk about this. Because season two, I got to say, I didn't watch season one, but I'm all into season two now, thanks to you to prep for the show. I'm like, hold on. Where's the surprise element here of you guys being thrown on a beach and not realizing you're being monitored 24-7? Because the name of the game is you're not allowed to touch one another the entire time. Or let's, we can't, how do we do this for morning TV purposes? I think you, you, I think you got to, it. I yes, think you got it. Yeah. You have to restrain yourself and build on an emotional level only. So tell us about what you thought you were actually going to Turks and Caicos for. It was a different show, right? They duped you. Yeah. Yeah. So they said parties in paradise. So I thought I was going to go on the beach and be able to like party meet a bunch of single people and then like Lana popped up and I was like, oh my Lord. And I hadn't watched the show, but I knew what it was. So I was like, oh God. Tell us who Lana is. Let's explain that. Lana is Lana like, is annoying. <laughs> she looks like a lava lamp, hence the name Lana, I swear. But she's listening, watching all the time. And if she sees you break the rules, you all lose money, right? The goal is yeah. like $100,000 and for every rule you break, she decides how much money you all lose together. Yeah, depending on what you do, like, um, you get charged more. But she's just annoying. But you know what? She did teach me a, a lot, so I, I give her props. How weird is it watching it back? Like, I've, I do plan on being a reality star one day. But <laughs> I would assume that moment where, because you guys wrapped up, like, by, uh, late last year, the shoot wrapped up. No, knowing the whole time this is going to happen, why, like, what's the feeling watching it? You know what? It was just like, I was just so excited for it to come out. And now that it's out, it felt really weird at first, but now I can watch it back. And I just like, I laugh at myself. It's like, I, I'm, I, it's good. I like it. I actually don't mind it. Listen, and I'll tell you for your platform, we just see everybody on this cast explode on social media. Talk to us about the difference it has made in your life in just a week. In a week, I've gained about 200,000 followers, which is bananas. Like that, my engagement is insane. Like, uh, yeah, brands are m reaching out to me. It's great. Yeah. What's it like watching yourself back and seeing it all <laughs> unfold on the show? It's good. I, honestly, I look like I look really like battered in it, <laughs> but it looks good. It's funny. I just look like I'm, I don't know. I look like I have like sunstroke, I feel. <laughs> no, you look great. You all look great. That's why you're cast for the show. You're all too hot to handle. Oh, no, I you know what I'm saying? Would you do any other reality show? Would you do like, you, you know, know we're doing Bachelor in Paradise Canada. Would you continue mm -hmm. on this theme of reality show star? You know what? I've been asked this question a lot. Um, I don't know. I, I, I guess I would, but it's not something that I want to keep doing. I think that was just like a good stepping stone, but I want to do a bunch. I want to get into a bunch of other stuff. I don't want to be known necessarily for reality TV. Okay. So what's next? Yeah. For you, like then? what? Like, yeah. what are you thinking? The world, you, have, you have a big platform acting. here. What are you thinking? I think I'm, uh, I kind of want to go into acting and then I really want to talk. I honestly really want to talk about like mental health and things like that. So I want to use my platform, not just to make a reality star, but yeah, for other things. What do you think it is about this show that people love? Is it because we're stuck in these COVID times, we want to see other people mingling? What do you think it is about this show? You know what, it, so it actually really grabs, it really grabs your attention. Like, I think it's just like you get so invested into like our journeys individually. And that's what I think. And also like everyone was so real on it. I'm being so honest when I say that I was completely myself. So I think it's just like, yeah, real people. Sorry, that's my puppy. And what did you learn about yourself? <laughs> Look, a little puppy. Puppy's like, I'm too hot to handle. What about me? Give me attention. Look, what, did, what, what did you learn about yourself, Carly? Just to be more confident and not, I was kind of, I was really insecure in the house. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but I really, I am, I was really insecure in the house and I just, I've just learned to just be myself, not, not let others judge me or let it bug me. Yeah. Um, again, uh, the show is too hot to handle. The first four episodes, it's trending number one on Netflix right now. They're out there now. The rest will uh, appear. No, they're out now. Excuse they're me, today, now. June 30th. Out. I saw the date. Yeah, Forgive yeah. me, Carly. Today, June yeah, 30th. That's okay. So uh, we, we appreciate you and uh, all the best with you and continue success with the show. Thanks, Carly. Thank you so much. Thank you. Love to you and your dog. What's your dog's name? Luna. Luna. <laughs> Luna, not Lana. Not to be confused Luna with Benji. Lana. It's no. Luna.
Thank you so much. Take care. <laughs> Hot you. new episodes. You. you can watch them now, friends. Coming up in the 8 o'clock hour, Orange Shirts are back with all proceeds supporting the Orange Shirt Society. Find out more in a little bit on how you can get one.